The journey that London Marathon has taken over the last 35 years is quite a unique and quite special one in terms of inspiring people to do a sport, inspiring people to raise money for charity by doing endurance events. And if you go back to the first year, 6,250 odd finishers, less than 5%, less than 300, around about 300 were women. Now it will be around about 37,000 are predicted to finish on Sunday, which will be the biggest field ever, and nearly 40% of them will be women. Um, virtually no money was raised for charity in the first year, and now over £50 million is raised each year by the runners who are, who are doing it. It really is what we like to say the greatest marathon in the world. My memories of the first marathon were really sort of nervous tension around the house. Uh, and I was at school actually at the time as I was 15, and came back for school holidays and my father asked could I sell the train tickets and help um, at the first marathon. I think really what hit me was the following day, the front page of the Daily Mail was Dick Beardsley and Inga Simonson crossing the line hand in hand and, and really it just showed the enormity of the event that they had found him. The Royal Marathon I think is so successful as it is because of this unique mix. It is the pinnacle of elite racing, the best runners uh, from around the world, the Olympic champions and world record holders taking part, but on the same day and on the same course, in front of the same TV audience, the same uh, 750,000 people by the Sunday Roads as the ordinary runners. You can't have that in you know, the FA Cup, you can't run up onto the course <laughs> at Wembley, you can't play tennis uh, at Wimbledon with Andy Murray, but you can take part as uh, on the same day as Olympic champions at London Marathon. And that's what makes it so special. You get to race day and there are thousands and thousands of volunteers. There are thousands of contractors and staff who are employed to put on this most incredible event. And incredible it will be on Sunday in terms of the athletes that we've got competing. It's the IPC Athletics Marathon World Championships. It is the greatest ever lineup of men and, and, and women runners. And so the crowd, I'm sure, is going to come out on Sunday, whatever the weather is. At the moment, the forecast is for it to be dry, but whatever the weather, I'm absolutely certain London will show what a great job it does of putting on, on an event, how much we love seeing athletics and how much we love seeing sport. Mm -hmm.